it's like I want to look beautiful and cool and be a badass at the same time. There was a tough primal edge in Alexander Wang's show today, which is very timely because this is a moment in America for women to embrace their strength. It started with our idea of the, taking the urban uniform, you know, the t-shirt, the board short, the windbreaker, the parka, and creating this tension between structure and fluidity. After last season, I wanted to kind of dissect the garments and create this illusion of the clothes floating on the body, but in a still a very strong and graphic way. That collection struck me as a very tough one. The music, the makeup, the whole scene is like the, you're going to a hard night out, but dressed super uber cool. We started looking at patterns such as croc and zebra and giraffe and snakeskin and python and kind of applying them to the garments but in an abstract way through embroidery. It was a tough collection. I mean, I love the cutouts of the backs. A lot of the garments have kind of croc spines piloted down the back. I want to hear a European perspective on that collection. I think it's a good mix between Asia, Europe and, and, and America. So actually it's incredibly international then what we saw here. I, that's what I'm trying to say in a very bad English. He is that urban New York designer but with such a strong presence everywhere. I mean in Europe everyone wants to be dressed in Alexander Wang. It's very international. Yeah. Do you think it's a response to the color and the print that we've been seeing, that now we're yes. going to go back to something that's a bit more reduced? Definitely, but we still have the glow in the dark. But you have to find a dark to glow in then. In Miami, there's plenty of nightclubs everywhere. <laughs> I like this idea of the beast within, though. Do you feel that that's a significant statement to make right now? I think it's a great time for women to be very strong and powerful and, you know, to be making statements out there on their own. And, and uh, I, it's something that I fully support.